Hi, so I guess everyone has been waiting to find out how to use baritone on Minecraft. Um, I'm going to explain it in this video. Um, I hope to do it pretty quickly and pretty self-explanatory. Um, so we need a couple of things. So we need a client that can run baritone. For instance, I'm a big fan of Meteor client. However, I'm going to advise you to be careful of this because some servers do not appreciate it. It allows you to have um, advantages over other players and I just want to raise some caution towards that because you might be banned on servers if you s use any of the other uh, tools within Meteor. So just be careful and uh, just be respectful of using it as well um, because it's an advantage to other players. Um, personally, I just use it in single player, um, the Meteor client and Baritone. I, whenever I'm playing online, I do not use Baritone or Meteor client. So just just keep that in mind because it can be considered disrespectful. So once um, you've got the, these pages open, make sure to head over to downloads, press release, whatever release you're using. And in my case, I got 1.19.2, uh, which I already got downloaded down here. Um, on the next tab, I've got the installation ready for the Minecraft launcher. So just press this button and I have it also down here. So the next and last thing we need is the API. So just press download and you know, it, it works like that. You just download it like that. I already got it downloaded, so I'm not going to show you how to download. I can figure, I can guess you can figure that out on yourself. So once we got these downloaded, first thing we need to do is press the fabric installer. It's going to open up the screen and make sure to select whatever variant you're using. In this case, I've downloaded um, the Meteor Client 1.19.2. So I'm going to select also the Fabric Installer to 1.19.2. Um, so as you can see, I've selected it and I just need to press install and it's done. However, I already got it installed, so I will not press install. I'm just going to close this. Um, I'm also going to close this and this and we basically don't need to browse anymore but what we now need to do is to install the api and meteor client together onto minecraft um we can do that by writing the windows key plus r at the same time write the percentage app data percentage and press enter we should get into a screen like this and we see at the top dot minecraft which is the folder we want to go into and we'll see a bunch of folders. Um, the only one that really matters to us at this moment is mods, a folder called mods. Um, it might be that this folder is not generated yet. Um, what you can do to generate this is start Minecraft, select a fabric profile, which you installed just before. And once it's uh, starting the game, preparing the game, and once it launches the game, just directly close it. You don't need to go and play the game. The folder should be generated. Um, once it's generated, just double click on it and drag the Fabric API in there and the Meteor Client in there. Just make sure that these are always the same variant. So 1.19.2 and the Meteor Client is also 1.19.2. Um, what happens is if they are not the same variants, there might be issues with the game or even trying to start the game at all. So make sure these are connected. And again, I would like to raise some awareness. A Meteor client is essentially a cheating client. It gives you advantages over other players. Make sure you do not use it in a respectful manner. Um, servers will not enjoy it. Um, other players will not enjoy it and it's not fair to other players. So make sure just to use it in private and just use it properly, wisely. Right, so if you have any more questions, feel free to write them in the description below. Um, I will try my best to reply on them whenever I can, and however I see fit, of course. Also, make sure to subscribe. I'm trying to grow my channel. I'm a small channel, um, but I do enjoy being creative and explaining some basic things to you guys. So I hope you enjoyed this, and um, yeah, make sure to subscribe. Thank you.